The Madison Dodgers finished last year 6-14, and third in the Liberty Division. This year's squad is heavily senior-driven. However, those seniors don't have the most experience that you would expect from a four-year wrestler. For head coach Mike Goodwin entering his fourth year with the team, training some of those inexperienced wrestlers to be able to put them in the key matches is the goal of this season. Just uh, wrestling hard, practicing, and doing the best we can. Uh, we got some new guys, so we're incorporating a little bit of new technique with some old technique. Uh, we look to be very competitive in our division, and hopefully, you know, finish in that upper upper part of it and qualify for the playoffs. Some openings right now that we're hoping to close, and, and from there we'll see how it goes. Senior Nick Lammy, who finished last year 18-12, and 12, has been working with the squad this year to get the extra reps in. He's noticed a difference in the way they approach the wrestling this year. Uh, we've been working real hard. We worked real hard in the offseason, like lifting like two, three days a week. Uh, we've been running real hard, and I mean, like, we have less guys than kind of like the freshman basketball team, but we're in there, we're grinding out, we're working real hard. Um, we're lifting a lot after practice, and we're trying to get our runs in. A big thing during practice, we're trying to drill a lot harder and keep the flow going, because uh, sometimes if we got no flow, we don't get like into the match, or when we get on like the big spotlight, we kind of lose one move to the other. So we're trying to do a bunch of chain wrestling and uh, keep our heart rate going, fill up the lungs with air, and uh, wrestle hard. The team also lost senior Dominic Lapina, who decided not to come out this year. However, junior Kiriakos Kasadakis and senior Santiago Arango, who should start at 285 and 220 respectively, should negate the loss. This Dodgers team should improve on last year's performance. I look for them to finish closer to 500 and third in the Liberty Division. For GardenStateHSWrestling.com, Donald J. Brower reporting.